Thank you very much indeed for uh, staying with us. We're truly grateful that you can be part of the show and you are our special guests. Uh, we still have Opinyi Kwame Jantwa here, legal practitioner and member of the CPP. Mr. Philip Landing is a, new a member of the New Patriotic Party and a land economist. We were just eulogizing uh, Professor Kwesi Bochehul, um passed on, I think, last week? Saturday. Saturday, Saturday indeed. Um, the news broke. I shouted, and someone in my house said, what is it? Because I believe Professor Kwesi Bochwe and, is it Kwame Mpieni? Kwame Mpieni or? Mpieni. The economist. Yes. Are, the, are two gentlemen who should have left this country. And we need them to do that. Yes. This, for me, yeah, and so I will not allow uh, Kwame Mpieni to leave before I say this. Mm. I believe that yeah. he is a material He's that material. we should have yeah. had as a president yeah. in this country. Yeah. And I, I don't know, but with, I shouted really. I said, what happened? I'm like, no, this man is gone. He was my boss. Okay. When I was commissioner of NDPC. Okay. Yes, 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 the, the boss yeah. of that. Boy, Look at the profile. He's astute. You see, Boche, when we were going through the documentation and discussing some of the things for the long-term national development plan, he would wait for everybody, he would listen to everybody's point of view, everybody, all the commissioners, before he professed his own solution. It was, it was a pleasure working with him. He made you feel comfortable in his presence. Mm, mm, mm. Comfortable in his, and respected everyone. On, 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 on the committee. I, I mean, we have lost a very dignified person. These are the kind of people mm. uh, who can rule this country. Mm. These are the kind of people. Look, you and me, you talk about mm -hmm. when PURC had their, their 50th anniversary, the 50th anniversary, mm. anniversary, his statement alone about where the country is today, and he wasn't reading any script. He wasn't reading any script. Ditto, ditto. His conclusion came to the fact that at this point, if we don't do something about it, where we are heading for in the next five to ten years is going to be very challenging. Why are such people sitting around the table negotiating on our behalf? They are in the Why aren't they? There are people in the opposition there are people who aren't in government. There are people who have been in government and seen it before. Why aren't they around the table? And the president insists on one person, one person, even if these people sitting around the table would contribute to the finance minister in terms of his negotiation. Would that not, would, would that not help us? Unfortunately, we've lost somebody like this. And we've got to a stage in this country hmm. where when it gets to a point, we should put partisanship aside and pick those from either party or from country to help do this country, especially in situations like this. What did the government say when they, when they came 2017? They will add value. It's not going to be taxes. They will add value to natural resources. Where are we today on that call? The national-based economy. Where are we today on that call? If for nothing at all, the finance minister should have looked at the cost of production. Has he? Has he? He should have looked at the dollarization of our economy. Has he? He should have looked at imports. Has he? Having these things contributed and fewer, having they contributed to where we are today, so why should he stay? The, 